I don't want to spoil the series for you, but Jill Saves the Prince. This is the third part in the Jill of the Jungle trilogy, and I just played the first part and things didn't record properly. So instead of playing the first part again, although it would impress you with my amazing skills, um, I'm just going to jump right into the third part. And this is Jill Saves the Prince. So she's been all around the place looking for the prince. And this is, oh, this is different because it's a top-down map as opposed to the side to sidey map, which is what we had earlier. Side to sidey map being a technical term. So this is more sort of the Zelda Commander Keen type thingy. And I haven't played this particular game since, um, in fact, I don't think I've ever played this one. I played the first one. How do I jump? Shift. One of the problems, apples give you health. One of the problems with games these days is if you're playing these old games, there is a Windows key right between the control key and the uh, alt key. So eventually you'll just end up opening all your folders. How do I get up there to get my knife? I want my stabby knife. I want to stab things with my knife. I can't double jump, so we'll just go over here. Maybe down here there's a double jump. Nope, there's a cave. I shall run through the cave. Uh, additionally, Jill's changed her, oh, I go up here, changed her bathers. She was originally in green, so she's obviously had time to go home and get changed. Though I always wondered why she doesn't wear trousers in the jungle. Now, I need to find the alt key so I don't th throw, um, throw my knife. And the knife should theoretically come back to me at some point today. Oh, I see, it got stuck in the pit. So I'm going to have to die to get my knife back. There we go. It was worth it. At least now I know how to get my... Oh, I've got my knife already. Well, I have to go back up here anyway, because there's nowhere else to go. I'm just going to go run, 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 run up there. So hopefully this time I can... Um, maybe I'll just jump over the crab. Because the crab doesn't kill you, it just... Um, there we go. That way I don't, oh, and that way I don't lose my knife. Okay, that's a series of doors. Oh, I quite like the big thunk when I fall down. That is a woman who has landed. When I first got these games, I didn't have digital sound. I just had the onboard soundboard. Um, really? Oh, there we go. Um... So when I finally got digital sound, I played the first one about 20 more times just to hear the digital sound because I didn't, you know, get out much as a teenager. Look at the little tiny Jill running around there. So now I'm going through the village, which is probably full of ants and crabs because that's what villages are for. Oh, I get three knives this time. Oops. Helps if you hit the right key when you want to jump. A lot of these sounds just sound like sounds for the sake of having sounds. It's like, hey, we've got digital sound. Let's put all of the sounds in this game. There's no reason why jumping should make a noise. I'm just, I'm just saying. I know it's what, 22 years too late. Oh, wow, 22 years. Ah, I just suddenly felt really old. So not only do you get a Lynn Plays this week, you also get an existential crisis. Hey, they're supposed to die when they touch the knife, even if the knife's not moving. Did they upgrade that mechanic? Rude. Okay, I got you at least. Yes. Oh, and then I completely got so excited I plummeted to the ground. This is like no village I've ever seen. I'm not saying this to mock this game, because I love this game. I have a huge amount of nostalgia for this game. I'm actually currently having the best time. Oh. He's not very nice. I don't care for him. I'm going to go down here. Rude. Okay. Can I kill them? No. Alright. So we will just get violently injured. Oh, uh, no. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, uh. Ooh. That was quite a harsh death. I feel bad for Jill. Poor Jill. Oh, run away from that. Crouch. Knife back. No. 
No, I'm just going to have to jump it. Okie dokie dokie dokie. No. I feel like I used to be better at the controls than I am now. Although, didn't we just say it was 22 years ago? Wow. Oh, yeah, there's the big scary demon guy. I don't want to go up there. Oh, I have to. Oh, there's no way around it. Oh, yes, there is. Is there anything up here that I should know about? Because I feel like they've put the chains in. There might be something up there that I should probably know about. I'm Jill of the Jungle. I have every right to be nosy. Nope. No, oh, I forgot about them. Well, pfff. Just gonna go right through it this time. No mucking around. Can I jump down? No. Some games, you know, they've got those platforms and you can jump down. If you press down and jump at the same time. You know what I mean. Oh, this is... Okay, timing. There we go. Oh, everything just wants me dead. And all I want to do is save the prince. It's a noble. I think you'll find it's a noble thing. Oh, key. Oh, no bird. Bird of death. Key. Do I have to go all the way back now and open that door? But things want me dead. Insufficient apples for my purposes. Can I cheat? Oh, look at all the apples. Just as I was complaining about the apple situation. There we go. I'm all healthy now. So now we time it. Oh, see, sticky keys. I don't know if you saw that, but um, because I am jumping a lot, Windows thinks I want to turn sticky keys on. And I don't really want to turn sticky keys on. Oh, I forgot about that. So many things I forgot about. Do I have to kill the demon guy? Because I kind of feel like he might kill me. So I'm just going to sneak under him. We'll just pretend we never saw him. Little secret between you and me, big demon guy. The door opens, I get a gem, and I'm back into the jungle map. I'm so tiny. I'm just like six pixels. Here I go. Six little pixels wandering around. And now I'm in the dam. It's very pink. Okay, I got a... Um, button to press to jump. Find the right button. That's a throwing star. Excellent. Only works downwardsly, if I recall. And downwardsly is a word. Okay, I don't want to go in the water because I will die. I'm just going to keep going down. Let's see what's down here. Oh, big ant. Okay, how do I kill that one? I'm going to have to get all right up in its face. Yeah. Oh, it was a double jump and I can't get it because I can only do a single jump. That seems unfair. I must be able to drop from the top. Get some apples. Apples give you health. So, I should be able to kill this. I don't know if I point in the right direction. I can kill the ant. Kill the ant. Ant is dead. But I can't jump up there because I need the double jump, so we shall go through here. Oh, bees. Bee situation. Bee situation. Run away. They're chasing me. I don't care for that. I just had to kill a frog. It goes against everything I stand for. Mostly I stand for frogs. Oh, except for the ones that are trying to land on my head. How is a frog deadly? Let's just have a little think about that because... Oh, okay. I don't know where I am. So this is a timing thing. And also a don't fall in the lava thing. So that's two things I'm pretty bad at. That looks like it might be death. So I'm going to go back the other way. Or I could just fall in the lava. Do I have to start all over again? I don't even know where I was. Let's go down here. There's nothing down there. Let's go back up here. Or maybe if I... Do I drown? Yeah, I drown. I think there is a level in the first one where you get to be a fish. 
or a frog or something. What I'm trying to do is get that double jump and not get stung by bees. So we'll just run past the bees real quick so they don't know I'm there. How do I get the double jump? It was down here where everything went wrong, wasn't it? So we'll just carry on, sally forth. There's nowhere else to go. Okay, so I'm going to jump over that. Jump over that. Can I go up here? Is there anything up here that's worth knowing about? much easier when you are holding the right buttons to jump and stuff. Let's see if I can get this. No. Okay, I'll just carry on. Just pretend I didn't even try. Pretend I didn't even try. Okay. Alright. So I think I'm back now in the double jump. I've got no idea where I'm supposed to be going. See, when I did the earlier video, before that didn't record properly, I played the first version and I just blew through it. I was amazing. I really wish it had recorded properly so you could be massively impressed. Can I jump up to the... No. I need the double jump. How do I get it? It is a mystery. I don't know if you heard that, but I just killed a mosquito. Got about 9 million mosquitoes in the house currently. I'm so lost. Oh look, this one's... I've forgotten about that. This has got turtle mode. Let's try going down here again. It's the only possible explanation as to where to go. Oh look, there we go. Double jump. Now I can go up here, not up there. Up here, up the other one. Um, yeah, turtle mode. I'm so nostalgic right now. Oops. My nostalgia got me hit in the face with a bird. Take that, nostalgia. Oh, look at everything. Everything wants me dead. Oh, I'm going to need some apples soon, because apples give you health. So I'm just going to go up here. I don't know what's up here. Okay. Alrighty. I can go up there. Oh, I guess, think I need to be a... Your goal is to guide your... Thank you for the how the heck to play 13 minutes after I've been playing. Always keep your eye on your health. When you find apples, your knife, keys and doors, secret icons, turtle mode for the less nimble among us. There we go. That's why I was feeling nostalgic for turtle mode. There's bees coming at me again. So presumably, if I keep going down like this... That's weird. I've only got one thingy, but the birds aren't moving, so that's okay. Let's turn on turtle mode. There we go. Turtle mode is like slow motion. For those of us with the reflexes of me. But I'm finding that a little too slow, so we'll turn that back off. Now I can't go down there because I'll drown if I go through. If you go through the top of the water, you die. Aha! Sticky keys. I don't want to turn on sticky keys. I am just trying to fly. I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. I wonder what that little narrow passage was for. Now I know. Don't touch the water if you're a bird because you will um, die. Finally out of that level. How long did that take me? Two hours? Slight exaggeration. Taking my little six pixels for a walk. Oh, let's go. Let's keep going past this. Let's go down here. Oh, there's a brick. I can't go past the brick. Go up here. What's in here? What's in here? Oh, the ship of the giant green lizard men. That bodes well. Have I got a weapon? Not yet. Is there a weapon up here? No. There's an apple. Hit the right button when you want to jump, dear. Well done. 
I don't think I want to enter the ship of the giant. Oh, there we go. I don't have a weapon. I've got nothing to hit the giant green lizard, lizard men with. I've got a key. Apparently the flags are worth points if you touch them. There we go. And they also scream in agony. So we'll just wait for you to go past, mate, because I have... Is there a weapon down here? No, there's a giant green lizard man, though. And a gem, and... Oh, run away, don't die. Good advice, I find, even when you're not playing a game. Run away and don't die. Oh, I need a key, I need a key. Oh, big giant lizard man. Oh, no, oh, don't kill me. Oh, okay, so this this key. Now, where did I need the key? Because I don't recall. Go up here. Might be something up here I need to have. Yeah, lizard man. Why are... I got just a quick question here for you. Why are the giant green lizard men on a ship? I need an apple. Apples give you health. Oh, I can't jump off the top of a rope. Never mind. That's a chain anyway. Pay attention. No. Oh, the reason I can't jump is because I'm pressing the wrong button. Shock. I genuinely don't have a weapon. I find that disconcerting and uncomfortable. Okay, now there's a lizard guy coming for me and I don't like that. I don't care for that. I don't care for that. No, don't chase me. I need to go up here. No. Ugh. Just go over here and get an apple. Have I got another key? I have. Amazing. And that's another gem. I've got three gems, so we can go out now. Oh, unless I die. Which I probably will, because I haven't got a weapon. Oh, run away from the lizard man. Run away. Just stand there. I don't think he can get me if I'm on the chain. He can try. He can look at me. Nice mohawk. No! So we'll just wait for him to go under there. Oh no, you're just you're so rude. Ah, oh, lizard man. Ah! Oh, death! Okay. Try that again. <laughs> Hit the right button when you want to jump. There we go. Good oh. Oh man, I did hit the right button and I died anyway. You will have noticed that there is no limit to the number of lives you can have. Which is probably quite good, because I never would have finished this game. Oh, don't touch the things, they're bad for you. Wasn't there a key up there before? Does that count as already all completed, does it? Alright, I don't know why I'm asking you. You're not even here. Oh, it does count, I think. Was that where I was? Oh, I don't know. Up there. What's up there? Nothing. Okay, yeah, it does all count, so I don't have to do all that again, which is quite good, because I would get lost. Oh, look, it's a thingy. Piranha. <laughs> I can't always think of the word right away, so just, you know. Snake. Well, that was an interesting level. It doesn't seem to have gotten me any closer to my goal of saving the prince, though. We'll do one more level, <clears throat> and then I am done, and then I will say that's enough of that. It's this one. It's the aqueduct. Did that just sneeze? Because that wasn't me sneezing. Something just sneezed. Oh, okay, fall right down. Oh, I get a knife this time. Good deal. I don't need the apple just yet. Oh, maybe I'll take the apple because I seem a bit low. No, I was wrong. I didn't need the apple. So that opens that, but then I have to go up here. I have no key. Alright, so if we go down here... Maybe I shouldn't have flicked that. Oh, that's a very noisy thing. Oh, okay. Alright. That makes no sense, but okay, we'll go up there. Key. Go along here. Oh, maybe I need to be... Maybe the... Ah, uh, we'll find out. We'll go up here and see what happens. Ah, oh, frog. Frog. Frog to the face. Ah! Although I suppose it does make sense that there would be frogs at the aqueduct, doesn't it? Okay, let's see if we can kill some of them. Uh, 
I don't know where they all went. I need a key. I haven't got a key. Screaming flag. <laughs> I feel so bad killing frogs. Sorry, I forgot to talk because I was really involved. I'm having quite a good time. What's down there? Water. If I hit the water, I will drown. I have to go into the water from the side. This is what I have learned. Hey! Oh, cool. Loads of keys, loads of keys. Oh, I see. That's a door that you have to unlock from that side. Good oh. Throw some knives. That's not really the sound a knife makes when you throw it. Oof. Never mind. It's also not the sound a knife makes when you catch it. It's definitely. Um, digital sound was new and everyone was really excited about it and therefore everything had to be quite soundy. Ah, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Wow. Okay. Wow, that was amazing. I'm amazing at this game apparently. So, I'm. that's it for me. I'm just going to wander around my little, my little pixels while I talk to you. If you've got any suggestions for um, old games that you'd like to see me play next week, uh, I can absolutely have a bash. So leave them in the comments or don't. It's up to you. Um, if you have any particular uh, preferences, I don't know why I said that. I've run out of words to say. I'm trying to sound all professional and it's, it's kind of a lie. So I'm just going to leave it there, and I'll see you next week. And on behalf of myself and tiny little six-pixel Jill, thank you very much for watching. It was it was kind of you. I appreciate it.